We are using the microfoil method of just reading a few pages every day until we've read the whole book. <laughs> We're reading half as his, uh poetry in translation in English. And, uh, we had read previously. Uh, uh, I'm just going to go on. Uh, page 78. These preachers who make such a show of pulpit piety act in a wholly different way when no one's there to see. <laughs> Interesting. This is my question for the wise. How is it those who teach repentance are so rarely found to practice what they preach? <laughs> hmm. You think they'd not, they'd no belief in God, or is his judgment day given their frauds done in his name, the pious tricks they play? My master reigns among the ruins, and the poor whom he attracts know, needing nothing's wealth and pride's humility. It seems attracts, needing nothing is wealth. So if you need your if you say, I don't need anything, you must be very wealthy. <laughs> and pride's humidity, humility. How is that pride's humility? Hmm. Oh God, these nouveau riches, riches, the slaves and mules that they display, set them upon their donkeys now and send them on their way. <laughs> hmm. They're like nouveau riches. <laughs> And angels say your prayers before. Love's tavern door, its shade, is where the clay of Adam's needed and mankind is made. His boundless beauty slays the lover, and even as he dies, out of the darkness seeking love, new multitudes arise. But hurry, Sufi, in the house where Magians meet, they give the liquid that revives men's hearts and makes them truly live. Empty your house, my heart, so that your sovereign may preside there, since gas-grasping fools despoil both heart and soul when they reside there. At dawn a cry came from heaven, the heavens, and reason said, I see. The very angels know by heart ah, Fez's poetry. <laughs> My goodness, that is funny. Now the angels know his poetry by heart. <laughs> That's cute. I'm a jealous of Fez now. <laughs> his, the angels know his poetry, but they don't know mine. <laughs> I'm very jealous. <laughs> Are you jealous of Hafez? Mm. No, happy. You're happy for him. All right. All right. Next poem. The nightingales are drunk. Wine red roses appear, and Sufis all around us. Happiness is here. How firmly, like a rock, repentance stood. Look how a Wine glass taps it and it lies in pieces now. Bring wine from the sequestered court where they've, we are secluded. Drink, drunk and sober, king or soldier, none will be excluded. This inn has two doors and through one we have to go. What does it matter if the highway is high or low? If there's no, no sorrow, there can be no happiness. Hmm. And when the world was made, men knew this and said yes. Uh -huh. hmm. Before he said that sorrow doesn't belong in a wise man's heart, but at the same time, no sorrow, how can there be he happiness? About, now he knows about all the whole of humanity. If there's no sorrow, there can be no happiness. And when the world was made, men knew this and said yes. They knew this was an unhappy place, and they came down here anyways. <laughs> Rejoice, don't fret at being and non-being. Say that all perfection will be nothingness one day. 
the horse that rode the wind, Asaf, is in all his glory. The language of the birds are now an ancient story. They've disappeared upon the wind, and Solomon, the master of them all, has nothing now. There they have gone. Don't rise on feathered wings, don't soar into the skies. An arrow falls to earth, however far it flies. <laughs> How will your pen give thanks, Hephaz? Now men demand your verses everywhere and pass them hand to hand. <laughs> He's popular, dear. Mm -hmm. I like that one. How will your pen give thanks, Hephaz? Now men demand your verses everywhere and pass them hand to hand. How's he going to give thanks when the men demand his verses? <laughs> Strange. <laughs> Hmm. Hmm. Reading a third poem from Hafez. Muslims, time ha was it it had a heart. Hmm. Time was I had a heart. A good one, too. When problems came, we'd talk, and I'd know what to do. And if I tumbled in grief's whirlpool, my heart was sure to give me hope that soon enough I'd reach the shore. A sympathetic, generous heart, a heart prepared to help out any noble soul, a heart that cared. This heart was lost to me within my lover's street. God, what a place where I succumbed to sweet deceit. There is no faultless art. We all fall short somehow. But what poor beggar's more deprived than I am now? Have pity on this wretched soul and sympathize with one who once upon a time was strong and wise. Since love has taught me how to talk, each little phrase of mine is cried up everywhere and showered with praise. <laughs> but don't call Hafez witty, wise, and intelligent. I've seen Hafez, I know him well, he's ignorant. <laughs> <laughs> Mm-hmm. Funny. He's ignorant, dear. Mm -hmm. You're calling him witty, wise, and intelligent. And you think he's got good poetry. <laughs> hmm. We got a fourth poem. <laughs> Perhaps, my heart. The wine shop's doors will soon be opened, and all the cramping knots in which we've tied will be untied. And if they're closed... To because of one ascetic's canting pride, be strong, my heart, because of God, this will be rectified. I swear by a reveler's heart that those who drink at dawn have pride, and apart with prayers so many doors, their prayers were satisfied. That's cool. Hmm. Hmm. If you drink at dawn, your doors... My prayers might be satisfied. Right now, the allergy for grapes, fair child, since she has died. And make her mourners weep with such despair, it's blood they've cried. Sever the harp strings now in grief for wine's cruel homicide. Look wise, the locks of those young boys who, who served wine at our side. They've closed the wine shop's doors. Ah, oh, God, don't let them open wide. The doors to shops whose wares are cant, pretentious, and pride. Hafez, this Sufi cloak you wear, tomorrow it won't hide. The heathen underneath, and all you've claimed to be, belied. <laughs> He's hiding behind his Sufi cloak. <laughs> hmm. 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 April 8th, it's Buddha's birthday. And how could it be his death and his birthday? That's strange. Hmm. Hmm. To 85. We read 78 to 85. Hmm. We were reading from the Penkwan Classics of Hafez 
faces of love, the poets of Saras, Dick Davis. Mm -hmm. Very good. You got a message now. <laughs>